Hey everyone, and welcome to our info session for Varsity Athletics at Loyalist College. My name is Ben Quaif, and I'm coming to you from the Loyalist Marketing, Communications, and Recruitment team. And I'm delighted to be joined today by the GOAT of men's volleyball, Josh Roberts. Josh, thanks for joining us today. Hey Ben, I uh, don't know if I would say GOAT. I appreciate that though. I'm happy to be here. I hope you're doing well. Well, thanks. And I hope that you're doing well as well, my friend. And we wanted to kind of start this info session off by giving an overview of the varsity athletics options at Loyalist College. Why don't you share some of those with our audience? Yeah, for sure. So we've got several men's and women's teams at Loyalist, including men's and women's basketball and volleyball and women's specific rugby and soccer. We also have cross country, which is men's and women's. So we've got a lot of opportunities for those who want to come and play some sports. Excellent. Opportunities are endless. Uh, at Loyalist College, and obviously you had a really great experience as an athlete at Loyalist. Tell us a little bit about your own uh, experiences personally. Right on. So uh, I've been the men's volleyball captain for the last four years. Uh, came to Loyalist from Conception Bay, South Newfoundland, off a whim. Uh, our assistant coach, Jordan McCory, I've known him for quite a few years now. He just started coaching and reached out to me, asked me what my plans were. So he was able to get me down here to, Belleville, Ontario. I had no idea where I was. To me, Toronto was Ontario. Uh, Belleville didn't exist in my brain. So uh, it was quite a bit of fun. And like I said, I've been here for four years and just been enjoying the ride. Well, you joined us from The Rock and we were delighted to have you for your tenure at Loyalist. Can you talk a little bit about the scholarships that uh, varsity athletes have uh, the opportunity of, uh, of getting from, through Loyalist? Loyalist does a really, really great job with their athletes uh, in the financial department. So uh, all of our scholarships can go up to a maximum of $1,500 per semester. So for our, um, you know, two semester sports like volleyball and basketball, that means upwards of $3,000 a year for your scholarship. Scholarships are all based upon performance on the court or the field, as well as the classroom. All of our athletes have to keep a 60 average, can't fail any courses. So as long as you're doing your work in the classroom and working hard on the court or the field, you should be fine. Um, we've got a lot of different opportunities through coaching as well so basically the coaches make all the decisions for the scholarships so as long as you're working hard and doing your best uh, you'll have a good chance for it excellent advice work hard do your best and that's how you're going to succeed really as a student and in sports for sure um you know we're kind of going to roll through and we're going to touch a little bit on uh, the intra and extramural sports that uh, students will have the opportunity to participate in uh, right on. So I've been fortunate enough to work with the campus recreation team this past year. So we've got a lot of different sports, including league and drop in sports. So we're talking volleyball, basketball, ball hockey, ultimate frisbee. Uh, we've got a bunch of different ones. And one specifically we like to highlight is our extramural cricket team. So while it's not a varsity sport, our uh, cricket team does travel and play other colleges, playing a couple different tournaments, had some highlights, got some some pretty cool awards at our last couple of major tournaments, including a sportsmanship award. So if you're big into cricket, we've got a position for you here too. Um, I was hoping that you could talk a little bit about facilities. You know, obviously every athlete, they need to have good facilities at their disposal. Talk a little bit about what uh, a student will be offered at Loyalist College in terms of these spaces. Right on. So if you're coming to Loyalist College uh, now or the next couple of years, you've sort of lucked out. We've just got our brand new gym floor. It was our first year using it. It's beautiful with the volleyball court outline, very clear basketball court, badminton lines, everything you could sort of need. So our uh, main gym looks really good. We've also got our full-time fitness center with a bunch of state-of-the-art equipment, everything you could ever need to stay in shape for the season, or maybe you're trying to get that beach pod ready. Whatever you really need to do, our fitness center sort of has it all for you. And obviously some people, uh, I'm not going to be pointing any fingers, would be interested in getting that dad bod in shape as well. You know, it's not just about beach <laughs> bod. <in> <laughs> uh, so we're, we're kind of uh, had a good like touch point in terms of what athletes will experience and what options are available to them. But I was hoping you could touch, uh, you know, being an athlete yourself the last four years, again, you mentioned that you've been uh, a strong um, part of the volleyball team at Loyalist and the captain of that team. Talk a little bit about the relationships that uh, students can kind of form by joining and being part of these uh, teams at Loyalist. Right, so I would say some of my best friends I've ever made have come from athletics at Loyalist. So, you know, not just my own team, but with other teams, we've been very close with all the other varsity teams, but just the friends you make along the way is incredible. 
Uh, when you're going out on road trips with your team too, taking the bus long ways, we do a couple overnight trips as well as tournaments every year. So you get to go into the hotels with your team and sort of bond and get to know each other a lot better. It's a lot of fun. Uh, every person I've played with at Loyalist, I've been a fan of. I have a list of people that I keep in contact with from year one to year four. So the opportunity to make friends and connections through varsity sports is incredible. Excellent. So let's say that I'm a student registered at Loyalist College. I'm interested in getting involved. Talk, talk a little bit about general information, what the student can expect in terms of, you know, practice schedule, academic support, you know, equipment, the whole overview for us. Sure. So practice schedules vary by team. Uh, most teams are practicing between three to five times a week, depending on their game schedules. It really does depend on the team, though. However, you don't have to worry about mixed up times. The schedules are uh, all buttoned out at the start of the year, so you know exactly what you're going to be practicing and how long it's going to be. So you don't have to worry about that with your maybe you're working or you're trying to schedule some schoolwork in. It's going to be pretty easy to fit it into your schedule. Now, talking about schoolwork, We've got some really, really awesome people in our athletic department. They have an open door policy where you can just walk in. They can help you with any problems at all that you have. So if you're struggling in a class, they can point you in the right direction. We've got a lot of really awesome mentors that you can go to. We've got free tutoring services as well as counseling services. Maybe you're having a hard time and our athletic department does a phenomenal job of pointing you in those directions. Excellent. Excellent insights. I think that we've given a really good overview for any potential athletes out there that are looking to kind of get involved and join a team at Loyalist College. Is there anything else that you wanted to add, Josh, before we wrap up today's info session? Sure. I just want to say, um, if you're thinking about sports, don't be shy. I think a lot of people sort of veer away from playing varsity athletics because they think it sort of comes with this upper echelon, this title, it's going to be too much and everything, but you might get in there and you might have some of the best times of your life personally. I don't know how my life would be if I hadn't come to Loyalist. These past four years have been phenomenal. I've had so much fun. And like I said, I've made so many friends along the way. I'm very grateful for my opportunity. So if you're thinking about playing a sport, get out there and try it. Well, we're, we're very grateful that you decided to come to Loyalist College and that you're out there on the road sharing your great stories about uh, your experiences, you know, being a student at Loyalist and being an athlete. So thank you for all that you're doing, Josh. And thanks for joining us on this info session today. If you're at home and you're looking to apply to Loyalist College and become a varsity athlete, you can give us an email right now at recruiter at loyalistcollege.com. We can book an online or phone advising appointment, give you the information that you need, and also connect you directly to our varsity athletics department at Loyalist College. We can't wait to welcome you to campus, and we hope to connect with you soon. Thank you. Thank you.